the main thing I would say is rushing into rooms. Like one one way to do it is um is to basically it, it will really throw off your game. But to kind of practice this, um, just get into the habit of every single like room, every single archway, hit walk. Okay, and. Um, when you start doing that, it'll just be kind of like, and you seem to do it for like a split second. What that does is, um, it's just sort of like a mental reminder. Um, and you, you, kind of, you kind of train yourself, okay, I'm going to slow down here, I'm going to listen, and figure out where my opponent is first, before I go barging into the room. And uh, it, it's a really simple thing, and of course, it, you, know, you need to have your walk key you know, down to something useful, but... Um, I, I can't imagine someone who doesn't use walk in this game, but um, it's happened before. <laughs> but uh, yeah, so I mean, it's just a very subtle kind of training tool um, that that will kind of teach you to to kind of slow things down. And and another another piece of it is, you know, when you start doing that, then um, the next. Thing to learn, I would say, for fish sticks is run away. Learn to run away from fights. To, to be able to assess how well you're doing and how strong your opponent is. And if the fight isn't good, don't even start it. Like, at most, spam a rocket um, defensively and then just wait and get like a better position, get, you know, better timing, whatever it is that you need. Um, until you're really ready to have fights and it can make games kind of boring in a way um, because they might be really low scoring so you know it, it, these are all, all things that are that are really difficult to learn they're just something that come over lots of games of practice and this is going to be the tie breaking map between Jahar and Fishix Fishix picked up ZTN Jahar just picked up DM6 and Fishix is ready yeah, to go Jahar's movement is looking is looking a lot uh it was looking a lot cleaner than than fish sticks on dm6 prepare to like fight. even just moving a lot smoother. all right here we go uh, strafing three two yeah and actually one. king you're sounding kind of quiet are you back from your mic um here, let there me we go fix some stuff good all right so fish sticks getting the armor start jahar of course getting mega and um, so Fish Six should be thinking about the timing of that Mega Respawn. And so uh, I'm curious to see if he shows up on time. Now, Jahar has done a smart thing here because he's gone and basically avoided fights and stocked up on weapons. And the place should be at red armor. And uh, Jahar has been pushed off of it. So now Fish Six um, should be getting this item. Let's see where he's at. No. All right. So that's costly, and now Jahar can land damage as he picks this up. Got lucky. So both these guys not really paying attention to the items. Fistix is going to pick up the first kill. And uh, Jahar is chopping up, apparently. All right. Yes, good old Linux. Yeah, you can tell. Cells FPS of dropping. Yeah. Now see there, um, yeah, the sound. Well, there there were some there were some sound cues that kind of indicated how fast your heart was moving. Um, it. I have really good headphones, so I don't know if other people would necessarily hear the same thing, but oh wow, <laughs> nice, <laughs> nice shot. Um, but in my headphones, I, I could hear the, um, the sort of momentum of, of those jumps, you know, like I could basically tell how quickly um, Jar was coming in towards that red armor, and uh, so Fitz is actually sh shot behind Jahar kind of into the pillar when it was kind of like e even if even if okay what am I trying to say here um in that situation just shooting the item would have been better than trying to line up a square shot because the likelihood of getting a square shot is almost nothing because of that pillar and so by shooting the item you 
run the potential of getting your opponent to back off from it or trying to, you know, dodge damage, he might hesitate for just a split second. And quite frankly, in that position, that was all that Fish Sticks needed in order to drop in on that right armor and, uh, and cut Jahar off instead of the other way around. So, um, yeah, it took me forever to kind yeah, of get that see, out. Like just did. Yeah, it took me forever to get that like out. What but... you're explaining, Jahar. Just... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so thank you guys for, for demonstrating it, but just backwards. <laughs> Alright, so let's go take a look now. Jahar is on the recovery, and Fish is uh, stacking up nicely. So, on the recovery here, Fish Chick should be thinking about what weapons Jahar has based on where he spawned. So, my guess is uh, he has two weapons right now. And... Yeah, Fish kind of gave up a lot here. So at this point, Fish should know Jahar's got every, pretty much everything. And so Fish Stick shouldn't appear on Jahar's screen for quite some time. Um, unless it's going to be doing a peak rail. So let's see. Oh, great rocket. Nice rail. And now Fish Sticks can't come back into this room. Um, so again, you know, this is really the time where Fish needs to learn defensive play. And a lot of it should be slowing down and listening. I'm gonna, continue, I'm gonna continue to watch from Jahar's point of view because I think that's you know we'll be able to tell what Fish Six is doing based on whether or not he gets spotted. Now jumping he's offensively, really the, uh, yeah, go ahead. Yeah. Now he's really like the juggernaut. Like he he doesn't stop coming at you. You know. He, yeah. He just doesn't know when to stop. Okay, now Jahar is actually in really good shape already, and Fish is, you know, basically, even though he got a frag, he, um, he's, he's not going to be in position for, for anything. Like, he can't go for red because he's just, in, you know, he's not even at full health. So, well, that being said, red apparently is anyone's game. So, Fishix should be leaving this room and getting red right now. He's, he should be like, okay, Jahar is stuck over there. Fuck, I'll give him Mega. I'll take red. Because right now, staying, staying here too long, Fishix is going to die. Like, now he's about to lose everything. He's, he's going to lose the frag. And now Jahar, if he hightails it, can get red. Or, at best, Fishix will spawn and get red. But then have maybe Rail, maybe Plasma. And Jahar can walk into that and get the frag. Oh! Nope, lucky spawn, lucky uh, portal maneuver. Fistix got a nice close range buckshot. So, okay, all right. Shut my mouth. I don't mind being wrong. It makes the game a little closer. Nice move by Fish. Both those players are really worried about Mega. They're not really con so such like their concern isn't on red or both the yellows as yeah. much as it is on Mega. Now this is big for Fish because Jahar has at best a rail, now he's got nothing. Uh, Fish has extended his lead. And so so now, honestly, okay, Fish should be, should be thinking about when he picked up Red and when Mega was last grabbed. And um, essentially they're spawning at the same time. So, you know, like, yeah. I see. This is where I kind of disagree with what Jahar is doing at this point, because um, coming into this room, he should have been looking for just just doing damage. That's it. That's all he needs to do. He doesn't need to try to get the item. Yeah. He, needs to, he just needs to think about doing damage yeah. and getting away with his life, and then beating Fish Sticks to the red armor, which should happen in that situation if he's only looking to do damage. Because now he's about to give up a frag. And I see right there, if Fish switches a little bit late to the rail, he had the right idea. You know, a lot of these things, you know, they're, they're concepts that you, you know, after practicing a little bit more, you really start to just kind of string together. They become second nature. So, like here, Fish should be... <laughs> yeah. Like my... When Fish was up and waiting to see where Jahar is going to come from with that uh, red armor play, I probably would have spammed down a few rockets and then followed my own rocket down. Um, 